to the last class we are discussing the basics about uh, the reflection and we studied the reflection by spherical mirrors and we discussed the mirror formula after that uh, we are discussing the refraction of light and refractive index after that lateral shift normal shift okay so now the concept is total internal reflection total internal reflection okay so yeah, we are having a glass lab we are having a glass medium here and this is a medium and this is an interface that separates the a medium and the glass medium and we are having a source here this is the source and it is emptying the radiations it is emptying the light okay so when and uh, the light rays are in all possible direction the light rays from the source are all in all possible direction in that glass medium okay when a ray of light incident normally on the interface when the ray of light incident normally on the interface so it doesn't suffer from refraction it move from the glass medium to air medium directly without any uh, refraction okay and same whenever the light is moving from one medium to another medium there is a possibility of a refraction or reflection okay and say when the ray of light incident on the interface instead of the interface a part of light reflects and a part of light refracts or transmit one some part of transmit i hope to the kelavish salpa part in that na alli reflect age kudithirutada okay so when it incident normally to the interface so there is no Uh, any deviation or change in the path for that we call there is no refraction but when the light from the same source is incident on the same interface obliquely obliquely what happens so when the ray of light travels from one medium to another medium obliquely it has to it has to show the phenomena refraction as a result of refraction it is bending away from the normal line and we know the concept when the light moving from rarer to denser it bends towards the normal line and when the light is moving from denser to rarer it bends away from the normal line and see so actually it has to move in this direction like this but instead of this it is moving here it is bending away from the normal line okay and uh, okay so see here uh, the angle of incidence is lesser than the angle of refraction angle of incidence is angle of, is lesser than angle of uh, refraction okay then there is a one more ray which is incidenting on the same surface but compared to this one and this one the angle of incidence is increased angle of incidence is increased as a result the refracting angle also increased compared to the previous angle if you compare it with the angle of incidence just like that so angle of refraction put in angle is just like that okay and here so we increase the angle of incidence still more innu na just madidwa aage nantara see firstly for example nanu 30 degree madida it is 45 it so i increase to 40 here it is become uh, 60 or 70 and here i increase it for 50 which one angle of incidence i increase it to okay so as a result the refracted ray is at 90 degree the refracted ray is at 90 degree so 90 degree means that refracted ray just grazes the surface ಅದೇ ನಾಕರ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಇಂಟರ್ಫೇಸ್ ಅದಲ್ಲ ಈ ಎರಡನ್ನು ಸಪರೇಟ್ ಮಾಡುವ ಒಂದು ಸರ್ಫೇಸ್ ಅದಲ್ಲ ಆ ಸರ್ಫೇಸ್ ಅದ ಮೇನ್ ಲೈನ್ ಏನು ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ಅದು ಹಿಂಗೆ ಗ್ರೇಸ್ ಆಗಿ ಹೋಗ್ತದೆ ಈ ತರ ತಳಕೊಂಡು ಹೋಗ್ತದೆ ಅವಾಗ ಏನಾಯ್ತಾ ಸೋ ನಾರ್ಮಲ್ ಲೈನ್ 90 ಡಿಗ್ರಿ ಇರ್ತದ ಇದು ಸರ್ಫೇಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ಕೊಂಡು ಬಂದದ ಅವಾಗ ಏನಾಯ್ತಾ ಆಂಗಲ್ 90 ಡಿಗ್ರಿ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ಆಯ್ತಾ ಓಕೆ ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ಆಂಗಲ್ ಇನ್ಸಿಡೆನ್ಸ್ ಕೊಟ್ಟಿದ್ವಿ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ರೆಫ್ರಾಕ್ಷನ್ ಆಂಗಲ್ ಬಂದಿತ್ತ ಆಂಗಲ್ ಇನ್ಸಿಡೆನ್ಸ್ ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಮಾಡಿದ ರೆಫ್ರಾಕ್ಷನ್ ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಆಯ್ತಾ ಇನ್ನು ಇನ್ಸಿಡೆನ್ಸ್ ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಮಾಡಿದ ರೆಫ್ರಾಕ್ಷನ್ ರೆಫ್ರಾಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ರೇ ಗ್ರೇಸ್ ಆಗಲಾಗದ ಇದರ ಸರ್ಫೇಸ್ ಮೇಲೆ ಉಂಟದ 90 ಡಿಗ್ರಿ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ಆಗಿದೆ ನೀವು ಇನ್ನೂ ಆಂಗಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಇನ್ಸಿಡೆನ್ಸ್ ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಮಾಡಿದ್ವ ಇನ್ನೂ ಆಂಗಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಇನ್ಸಿಡೆನ್ಸ್ ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಮಾಡಿದ್ವ ಆಸ್ ಅ ರಿಸಲ್ಟ್ ಸೋ ಇಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ರಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ಆರ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಸೇ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ರಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ ಟು ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಮೀಡಿಯಂ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ರಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ ಟು ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಮೀಡಿಯಂ ಏನಾಗ್ತದೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಇಲ್ಲಿಗೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿಗೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಆಂಗಲ್ ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಇದೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿಗೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಇದೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿಗೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಆಯ್ತು ಅನ್ಕೋಬಹುದು ಆರ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಸೇ देयर ಇಸ್ ನೋ ಎನಿ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ಮಿಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಲೈಟ್ from the glass to air so the entire light reflected back to the same medium this phenomenon is called total internal reflection okay so in another way as the angle of incidence increases the angle of refraction also increasing at a particular angle of incidence 
at a particular angle of incidence, the refracted angle becomes 90 degree. And for this angle, we call the critical angle. We call it as a critical angle. Okay. And if we increase the angle of incidence, if we increase the angle of incidence, uh, more than the critical angle, more than the critical angle, then there will not be any refraction. The entire incident light, the entire incident light reflects back to the same medium. This is total internal reflection. So here I have to study. Uh, you have to remind two definitions. So make it a question. What is TIR? Total internal reflection. In short, we call it as TIR. Okay. And you make it one more question. What is critical angle? What is the critical angle for TIR? Okay, so how to define the TIR? How to define the TIR? I explain the thing. Whenever the light is moving from denser medium to rarer medium, whenever the light is moving from denser medium to rarer medium, the entire light, the whole light reflected back to the same medium, the whole light reflected back to the same medium without any refraction without any refraction for the angle for the angle i greater than c for the angle i sorry okay i greater than c what by i greater than c the angle of incidence must be greater than the critical angle okay so the definition was a tir when light travels from denser medium to rarer medium when the light travels from See here, glass to get tension medium to rare medium. It undergo, it undergo complete reflection. See this one. It undergo complete reflection for I greater than C. Here it is critical angle and we increase the angle of incidence further. As a result, instead of the refraction, instead of the grazing, it is reflected back completely. This is called TIR. Okay, so when a light travel from denser medium to rarer medium, it undergo a complete reflection for I greater than C. Angle of incidence must be greater than angle of critical angle. This is called TIR. Okay, and critical angle, we use the word critical angle. So what is critical angle? It is a special case of incident angle. It is a special case of angle of incidence. What is that special case? What is a special case? See, for particular angle of incidence, for which we, check, we get uh, the 90 degree angle of refraction, that is critical angle. So we can define it, the angle of incidence for which the angle of incidence for which the angle of refraction is 90 degree. The angle of incidence for which angle of refraction is 90 degree when the light travels from denser to rarer medium. So this is called denser to rarer medium, should right? Medium. Okay, so this is called critical angle. Okay, it's about TIR. And it's here, so what are the conditions to get the TIR? Total internal reflection. No, no. It has a two important conditions. What are those two? So the first one is the light must start from denser medium to rarer medium. Light must start from denser medium to rarer medium. Why to move? Why it has to move from denser to rarer only? Because while moving uh, while passing from denser to rarer, it bends away from the normal line. So there only there is a chance of a reflection back. Okay, so that's why it has to start. Uh, it has to move from denser to rarer. This is the first condition. And uh, second one. So if the light is moving from denser to rarer, can you get the TIR at all the case for all the reflection angle for all for all incident angles? No. And say we are not getting the TIR, even though there is no refraction also. Here you are getting the refraction, but it's not a TIR. Here you are getting the refraction, not TIR. You are getting the refraction, not TIR. This is the last case. So if you uh, increase further, so there will be reflection. So the angle of incidence must be greater than the critical angle. Usually it acts for two months. Here it must get equations. Write the necessary conditions for TIR. Okay, note it. Okay, now I want to get the critical angle for your payoff media. Now, control media is the critical angle. Find it more bigger than total internal reflection. Tagobeko, total internal reflection. Tagobekandre, angle of incidence, critical angle in the chastir beka. 
ಹೌದಲ್ಲ ಹೋಗಾಗಾದ್ರೆ ಕ್ರಿಟಿಕಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಗಲ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಗ್ ಫೈಂಡ್ ಔಟ್ ಮಾಡೋದಾ ರೈಟ್ ಸೊ ಟು ಗೆಟ್ ದ ಕ್ರಿಟಿಕಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಗಲ್ ವಿ ಶುಡ್ ವಿಶ್ ಸ್ಟಡಿ ದ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ಕ್ರಿಟಿಕಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಗಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದ ಆರ್ ಐ ಆಫ್ ಡೆನ್ಸರ್ ಮೀಡಿಯಂ ಡೆನ್ಸರ್ ಮೀಡಿಯಂ ರೆಫ್ಯಾಕ್ಟ್ ಇಂಡೆಕ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನು ಗೊತ್ತಿತ್ತು ಅಂದರೆ ಅದು ಕ್ರಿಟಿಕಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಗಲ್ ಅವನು ಆ ಮೀಡಿಯಂ ಕ್ರಿಟಿಕಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಗಲ್ ಅವನು ಈಸಿ ಆಗಿ ಫೈಂಡ್ ಔಟ್ ಮಾಡ್ಲಿಕ್ಕೆ ಬರ್ತದ ಓಕೆ ಲೆಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಆರ್ ದಟ್ ಸ್ಮಾಲ್ ಇಕ್ವೇಶನ್ ಸ್ಮಾಲ್ ಡೈವೇಷನ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೇ ಹಿಯರ್ ದ ಮೀಡಿಯಂ ಒನ್ ಮೀಡಿಯಂ ಒನ್ ಯಾವ ಮೀಡಿಯಂ ಒನ್ ಯಾವ್ದು ಇರ್ತದ ಡೆನ್ಸರ್ ಮೀಡಿಯಂ ಅಥವಾ ರೇರ್ ಅದ ಮೀಡಿಯಂ ಸೊ ಟು ಗೆಟ್ ದಟ್ ಯಾರ್ ದ ಲೈಟ್ ಮಾಸ್ಟರ್ ಮೂವ್ ಫ್ರಾಮ್ ಡೆನ್ಸರ್ ಟು ರೇರ್ ಸೊ ಮೀಡಿಯಂ ಒನ್ ಇಸ್ ಡೆನ್ಸರ್ ಡೆನ್ಸರ್ ಮೀಡಿಯಂ ಸೊ ಯೂಶಲಿ ವಿ ಯೂಸ್ ದ ಗ್ಲಾಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಐ ಸೇ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಎನ್ ಒನ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಐ ರೈಟ್ ಇನ್ ಜನರಲ್ ಇನ್ ಜನರಲ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ರೆಫ್ಯಾಕ್ಟ್ ಇಂಡೆಕ್ಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಎನ್ ಇಸ್ ರೆಫ್ಯಾಕ್ಟ್ ಇಂಡೆಕ್ಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಎನ್ ಗ್ಲಾಸ್ of R I n one equal to n and medium two medium two this is rarer medium rarer medium of refractive index n two equal to one if it is a so usually now we might do what error refractive index and the error now rarer medium but the concern might be the one okay and uh, what is snell's law was a snell's law we can write it from snell's law sin i over sin r is equal to n21 is it right okay then i can write it like a n2 divided by n1 clear next one for for i equal to c for i equal to c if incident angle equal to critical angle incident angle equal to critical angle then what about the angle of reflection if the incident angle equal to critical angle the angle of reflection angle of refraction is 90 degree is it i know you know n2 is n sorry n1 is n and n2 is 1 n1 is n and n2 is 1 so substitute these values in this equation so instead of sin i instead of sin i okay i'll continue here instead of sin i i'll write sin c i equal to c divided by sin of instead of r i'll write 90 degree sin of 90 degree equal to n2 is 1 n1 is n n2 is 1 and n1 is n i subtract that way okay what about the sin 90 it is 1 so sin of c is equal to 1 by n because sin 90 equal to 1 sin 90 degree equal to 1 okay so this is the relation between critical angle and refractive index or you can write n is equal to 1 divided by sin c okay the relation between critical angle of a medium and a refractive index of that medium okay if you know the refractive index of a medium if you want to get the ir in that medium so what to do so first you should take c is equal to sin inverse of 1 by n so it should, should take the reciprocal of the ir of that medium so you will get a some decimal 0. Point something okay and apply the sign function to that so you'll get a c is equal to some number so that will be the critical angle of that medium okay and it is important for three marks so usually exam get three marks get in derivation scale and the next point applications of tir applications of total internal reflection the first one is mirage okay have observed the mirage have you seen anywhere the mirage Yes, usually we can observe the mirror, mirror in hot summer days, hot summer days and most probably it occurs in desert lands. So desert area, the desert and the Marubhumi. Marubhumi is the one that we usually see the mirage in the middle of the day. The mirage in the middle of the day is the one that we see the mirage in the middle of the day. Usually the one that we see the mirage in the middle of the day is the one that we see the mirage in the middle of the day. 
ಪೌಂಡ್ ಇದ್ದಂಗೆ ಕಾಣಿಸ್ತಿರ್ತದ ಬಟ್ ನಾವು ಅಷ್ಟು ದೂರ ಹೋದ್ರು ಅದು ಕಾಣಿಸೋದೇ ಇಲ್ಲ ಆಕ್ಚುಯಲ್ ತಾಲೆ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಇರೋದಿಲ್ಲ ಇದಕ್ಕೆ ನಾನು ಕೇಳ್ತಾರ ಮರೀಚಿಕೆ ಆರ್ ಮಿರೇಜ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಫಾರ್ಮೇಶನ್ ಆಫ್ ಮಿರೇಜ್ ಆರ್ ದ ಮಿರೇಜ್ ಇಟ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಅ ಗೇಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಲೈಟ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಅ ಗೇಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಲೈಟ್ ವಿತ್ ಆನ್ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವರ್ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವ್ ಜೊತೆಗೆ ಏನ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಿರತ್ತ ಲೈಟ್ ಒಂದು ಗೇಮ್ ಪ್ಲೇ ಮಾಡ್ತಿರ್ತದ ಏನ್ ಗೇಮ್ ನೋಡ್ರಿ ಇಲ್ಲದ ಸೊ ಯೂಶ್ವಲಿ ನಮ್ಗೆ ಏನಾದ್ರು ಈ ದೂರಿಂದ ನಾವು ಏನ್ ನೋಡ್ತಾ ಇರ್ತೇವ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಈ ತರ ಏನಾದ್ರು ಈ ತರ ಇನ್ವರ್ಟೆಡ್ ಇಮೇಜ್ ನೆಲದ ಮೇಲೆ ಕನ್ಸಾದಿತ್ತ ಇನ್ವರ್ಟೆಡ್ ಇಮೇಜ್ ನಮ್ಗೆ ನೆಲದ ಮೇಲೆ ಕನ್ಸಾದಿತ್ತ ನಾವೇನ್ ಅನ್ಕೊಂತೇವ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಯಾವ್ದೋ ಒಂದು ವಾಟರ್ ಸೋರ್ಸ್ ಅದ ವಾಟರ್ ಪೌಂಡ್ ಅದ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಅಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟ್ ಅದ ಇಲ್ಲ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಅಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟ್ ಅದ ಇಮೇಜ್ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಬಿದ್ದದ ಈ ಇಮೇಜ್ ನಮ್ಗೆ ಕನ್ಸಲಾತದ ಅಂತ ಅನ್ಕೊಂತೇವ ಸೊ ಎಲ್ಲಾದ್ರು ಈ ತರ ಇಮೇಜ್ ಕಂಡು ಹೇಳಿದ ಅರ್ಥ ಏನು ಅಲ್ಲಿ ವಾಟರ್ ಅದ ಅಂತ ಏನೋ ಅನಿಸ್ತದ ಹೌದಾ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಏನಾಗ್ತದ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವರ್ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವ್ ಎಷ್ಟು ದೂರದಲ್ಲಿ ಎಲ್ಲ ಇದ್ದಾನ ಅವನು ಓಕೆ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವರ್ ನೋಡಿ ತಕ್ಷಣ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಟ್ರೀ ಅವನು ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಕುಳಿತ ಇದ್ರ ಮೇಲೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಟ್ರೀ ಇಮೇಜ್ ಕಾಣಿಸ್ತಿರತ್ತ ಅವನ್ಗೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಹೈಟ್ರಿ ಟ್ರೀ ಕಾಣಿಸ್ತಿರ ಹಿಂಗ ಇಲ್ಲ ಗ್ರೌಂಡ್ ಮೇಲೆ ಅಥವಾ ಮರಳ ಮೇಲೆ ಈ ಟ್ರೀಗ ಇಮೇಜ್ ಕಾಣಿಸ್ತಿರ್ತದ ಅವಾಗ ಅವ್ನ ಏನ್ ಅನ್ಕೋತಾನ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಏನೋ ವಾಟರ್ ಪೌಂಡ್ ಇರ್ಬೋದು ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ಟ್ರೀ ಇಮೇಜ್ ಇಲ್ಬಿದ್ದದ ಸೊ ನಾವ್ ದೂರ ಹೋದ್ರೆ ವಾಟರ್ ಪೌಂಡ್ ಸಿಗ್ಬಹುದು ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿ ನಡೀತಾ ನಡೆದ ಬರ್ತಿರ್ತಾರ ಬಟ್ ಎಷ್ಟು ಬಂದ್ ನೋಡಿದ್ರು ಇಲ್ಲಿ ತನ ಸಮೀಪ ಬಂದ ಫಾರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಒನ್ ಕಿಲೋಮೀಟರ್ ನಲ್ಲಿ ಏನೋ ಅನ್ಸಿರ್ತದ ಒನ್ ಕಿಲೋಮೀಟರ್ ಒಂದ್ ಬಂದ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಏನು ಇರೋದಿಲ್ಲ ಮತ್ ಒಂದ್ ಕಿಲೋಮೀಟರ್ ಮಾತ್ರ ಹಿಂಗ ಅನ್ಸಿರ್ತದ ಇದಕ್ಕೆ ಏನ್ ಕೇಳಿತರ ಮಿರೇಜ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಇದು ಹೆಂಗ್ ಆಗ್ತದ ಹೆಂಗ್ ಆಗ್ತದ ಓಕೆ ದರ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಸಿಂಪಲ್ ಥೇರಿ ಅಂಡ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಬೇಸಿಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಟಿ ಐ ಆರ್ ಟೋಟಲ್ ಇಂಟರ್ನಲ್ ರಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೇಮ್ ಅಡ ಆನ್ ಹಾರ್ಟ್ ಸಮ್ಮರ್ ಡೇಸ್ ಆನ್ ಹಾರ್ಟ್ ಸಮ್ಮರ್ ಡೇಸ್ ದ A which is closer to the surface, earth surface. Usually, now, design and notice one day, all sand is there, all mud is there. This mud is coming from the gas system. This gas or A system is very hot. How do you know that it's very hot? See, this is the section of the LR section. So, so, the A molecules which are here, so they are heated by this source, which is the source here, by the sunlight only. But, the air which is closer to the surface, but the air which is closer to the a surface the air which is closer to the a surface it is heated by the sunlight and the sunlight passes through that a medium and incident on the earth and reflects back okay and earth is also heated up earth heat up again to the sunlight to the earth the reflect again rays per hour and earth the heat rays per hour sun heat rays per hour so e medium in the last e section in the last it is a more heated region compared to other section go back to the okay and same level by level level by level the temperature of the a system is decreasing comparatively decreasing okay then the a level which is closer to the surface it is a heated area it is most heated area if the temperature of a is more what about the volume so because of the temperature the gases will be expands okay as a volume increased so rho equal to m by v was the rho density equal to mass by volume as the volume increases what about the density the density decreases okay so i can write that this is uh, more heat more heat so our density like that less density less density i can call it as a rarer medium i can call it as a rarer medium compared to the upper region okay so now and say now the ray of light incident in on tree yavdo ondalle tall tree da sunlight ga adu mel beltada bitachana ella rays ella direction la reflect aagi hogtirtava okay objects nam kai kanistava na last class alli explain madidina so source inda objects me light beltbeka in chakrasada okay so source inda ee chakras me light beltbeko aa bidanta light reflect aagi barbeka adu nam kanmel focus aagbeka namge chakrasada ant kanistu ಅಲ್ಲ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಯಾವ ಸೋರ್ಸ್ ಇಲ್ಲ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ ಆಗ್ತೂ ಮಿತ ನಾವು ಯಾವ್ದಾದ್ರು ಅಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟ್ ಇಳಿದ ಕಾಣಿಸ್ತದ ಏನೋ ನೋ ಯಾಕಂದ್ರೆ ಯಾವ್ದು ಲೈಟ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಮೇಲೆ ಬೀಳಾದಿಲ್ಲ ಸೊ ಅದು ರಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆಗಿ ನಮ್ಮ ಮೇಲೆ ಬೀಳಾದಿಲ್ಲ ಹಂಗಾದ್ರೆ ಯಾವ್ದಷ್ಟು ಕಾಣಿಸ್ಬೇಕಂದ್ರೆ ಅದು ರಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಫಿನಾಮಿನ ಆಗ್ಬೇಕಾ ಸೊ ಇದ್ರ ಮೇಲೆ ಲೈಟ್ ಇತ್ತು 
I am saying now the reflected rays from the tree are moving from upper level to lower level. Upper level and the image is colder region, less temperature. Less temperature. And that is how it is denser medium. Denser medium. Okay, now answer me from where to where the reflected rays are moving. The reflected rays from the tree are moving from lesser temperature to more temperature region. Okay, so you can write the the denser medium to sorry. Now the light is moving from denser medium to rarer medium. Denser medium to rarer medium. So whenever the light is moving from denser to rarer, there is a chance of TIR. Else, the angular incidence is greater than the critical angular. Okay, so when the light is moving from lesser to lesser, uh, denser medium to rarer medium, so there may be TIR and it looks like this. Rays are in the bar theta. You one bit to only get total angular reflection. I bit to opposing bar theta. E reflected rays. So, num cut will be touch num gain in sada three. E level gain in sada. So if I extend it back, so it looks like there. So the tree appears here like this. So this is inverted image of tree. Then we assume I make it appears like that. So there is a water pond. There is a water pond. That's why the inverted image of a tree is appearing for our eye. But in fact, there is no any water pond. It is just a game of the light. So what is the principle behind that mirage? That is total internal reflection. So when the light moving from denser to rarer medium, so the rays from tree are moving from denser to rarer, and they undergo the TIR, and those total internal reflected rays are focusing on our eye. As a result, we are getting image like this. Okay, and we assume, or we may feel there is a something water pond. So that's why we are getting an image of a tree. So this is called the mirage, and this is due to TIR. Okay, you may get a question. Explain the mirage on the basis of a TIR, or explain the TIR in case of a mirage. So we should write this much. Let us explain. Okay, once I repeat, on hot summer days, the air near the ground becomes hotter than air at higher level. I explained the air which is closer to the ground. It is at a high temperature and less density. We call it as rarer medium. And the air of upper level, it is of a high density. So density is larger because the temperature is lesser. Okay, so air of lower region, air of lower region of air becomes lesser. Than the area of a higher level air. Okay, and in such a situation, the ray of light from tall objects like a tree. I explained with the tree from the tall objects move towards the ground. Move towards the ground. It means the ray of light is moving from higher, sir, denser medium to rarer medium, and undergo TIR and creates an impression of reflection as if from a water pond. Okay, you should write this much if the R is correct. Explain the TIR. Okay, and the second application is optical fibers. Okay, uh, have you seen the optical fibers? Okay, optical fibers are like a uh, you can say these are a capillary glass capillaries and they are covered by a material of high refractive index. And it is used to it is used to Transfer the light from one place to another place by using the application by using the principle of TIR. So light na one place in the matam place ke transfer marle ke. This device use marte wa. This device engi the thoda pipe thara structure the thoda. Okay, capillary thara structure the thoda. Capillary the engi ke. So this thara glass the thoda. And glass ali sun da ke ron hole le ke. Sun da ke ron passage le ke ka. So thickness is le ke thoda. It is of order. Uh, Milli or micro, micro or nano. Our range is another one. Whole it all is not capillary. Can you tell me? So, when we do thickness test, it is that as much as the passage is allowed, it is that how capillary is that. Okay. So, now we need that. Dual zone bed is that. It is dual zero. Okay. So, it is that glass. This is a mirror bed. Capillary tube is that. Okay. It is made up of high quality of glass. High quality of glass. 
okay and it is covered by it is covered by one more type of material which is alpha which is alpha lower refractive index compared to glass so we now glass is made with alpha and this is alpha lower refractive index lower refractive index and this is high refractive index high refractive index middle layer of the high refractive index so illi nadha layer of low refractive index and a material which is uh, the material with the lower refractive index which is covered that is called cladding cladding and the inner glass material is called a core this is core and this is cladding okay so whenever the light is incident whenever the light enter the capillary enter the capillary see so when it reaches the interface of core and cladding interface of core and cladding there may be the refraction or reflection the two options so if we send the light if we allow the light to incident at an angle greater than the critical angle greater than the critical angle of the glass which is used as a core as a result there will be the complete reflection there will be complete reflection and this reflected ray again falls on the interface at an angle greater than the critical angle and it reflects again it reflects and reflects so and so on it reaches or it emerges out at other end of that core with the, the same intensity and same energy by this way we can send the light from one place to another place or we can say uh, we can send it up for a large distance without loss of energy okay it is about the optical fiber and how it is possible how it is possible to send a light for a large distance that too without loss of the energy it is possible only by the tir okay and you may ask so what is the use to send send the light for a large distance so what is the necessity see so, yeah, the optical fibers are widely used in communication system the used in communication system if you want to send a signal if you want to send a signal that signal may be audio or video or any information so if so for information we call the signals and first we should convert the electrical signals into light signals light signals and we should allow them we should allow the light signals enter the optical fiber with an angle greater than the critical angle then that information which is in the form of light so that travel for large distance and that will be received by that will be received by the decoder and that decoder converts the light energy into electric energy and that shows the information which was in the form of the light signal okay so this is about the optical fiber so you can define optical fiber as it is a device it is a device used to conduct the light along a desired path without loss of energy okay and it works on the principle of tir you will get a two marks question right write the uses of optical fibers okay you should write at least two uses that are used in communication that are used in communication already already explained and they are used by the doctor by the doctors for visual examination of inner parts of the body like intestine stomach and heart etc okay so and third one they are used they are used as decorative lamps you may have heard the endoscopy and angiography so which are the medical terms and in that endoscopy they use the tir so in that case so optical fibers na optical fibers na ನಾವು ಯಾವ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ನೋಡ್ಬೇಕಾಗಿದ್ದು ಆ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಅವ್ರು ರೀಚ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾರ ಸೋರ್ಸ್ ಇಂದ ಲೈಟ್ ಟ್ರಾವೆಲ್ ಆಗ್ತಿರ್ತದ ಆ ಇಂಟರ್ ಇನ್ನರ್ ಬಾಡಿ ಮೇಲೆ ಅಥವಾ ಇನ್ನರ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ಮೇಲೆ ಲೈಟ್ ಬೀಳ್ತದ ರಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆಗಿಬಿಟ್ಟು ವಾಪಸ್ ಮಾತ್ರ ಅದೇ ಪೈಪ್ ಮುಖಾಂತರ ಬರ್ತದ ಸೊ ಅದೊಂದು ಸ್ಕ್ರೀನ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಕಾಣಿಸ್ತಿರ್ತದ ಅದನ್ನ ಎಂಡೋಸ್ಕೋಪಿ ಅಥವಾ ಎಂಜಿಯೋಗ್ರಾಫಿ ಮಾಡ್ಬೇಕಾದ್ರೆ ನೋಡ್ತೀವಿ ಅದಲ್ಲ ಅಂಡ್ ಆರ್ ಯೂಸ್ ಆಸ್ ಡೆಕೋರೇಟಿವ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಪ್ಸ್ ಡೆಕೋರೇಟಿವ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಪ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಹೆಂಗಿರ್ತಾವ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಇವು ಇಲ್ಲೊಂದು ಪೈಪ್ ಇರ್ತದ ಇದು ಕೆಳಗಡೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಬಲ್ ಬೋನ್ ಆಗಿರ್ತದ ಇದು ಸೋರ್ಸ್ ಅವನು ಇಲ್ಲ ಎಲೆಕ್ಟ್ರಿಕಲ್ ಸರ್ಕ್ಯೂಟ್ ಇರ್ತದ ಓಕೆ ಇದ್ರೊಳಗಡೆಯಿಂದ ಹಿಂಗೆ ಆಪ್ಟಿಕಲ್ ಫೈಬರ್ ಹಾಕಿರ್ತಾರೆ ಹಿಂಗೆ ಆಪ್ಟಿಕಲ್ ಫೈಬರ್ ಸೊ ಇಲ್ಲೆಲ್ಲ ಹಿಂಗೆ ಪ್ಯಾಕ್ ಇರ್ತದ ಸೊ ಲೈಟ್ ಈ ಫೈಬರ್ ಅಥವಾ ಈ ಕ್ಯಾಪಿಲರಿನಲ್ಲಿ ಪಾಸ್ ಆಗಿ ಬರ್ತದ ಈ ಮುಂದೆ ಒಂದು ಸಣ್ಣ ಓಪನಿಂಗ್ ಇರ್ತದ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಲೈಟ್ ಆನ್ ಆಗ್ತದ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಲೈಟ್ ಆನ್ ಆಗ್ತದ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಆನ್ ಲೈಟ್ ಆನ್ ಆಗ್ತದ ಸೊ ಇಲ್ಲೆಲ್ಲ ಏನ್ ಕಾಣಿಸ್ತದ ನಮ್ಗೆ ವೈಟ್ ಕಲರ್ ಅಥವಾ ಬ್ಲಾಕ್ ಕಲರ್ ಫೈಬರ್ ಕಾಣಿಸ್ತಿರ್ತದ ಎಜ್ ಅದ್
and they use it as a decorative lamps. So this is by the optical fiber and uh, the principle of uh, TIR. Okay, the principle of TIR is used for the following cases. The first one is the formation of mirage. How the mirage forms? I explained on the basis of uh, that TIR and working of optical fiber. We discussed and the sparking of diamond. So diamond. Uh, अदन शेप कट मार सो पर्टिक्युलर शेप कट मादे कंप्लीट टैर आद सो एज रिसल्ट दिल बी द स्पार्किंग एफेक्ट ओके एंड बेडिंग ऑफ लाइट बै द प्रिजम सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू बैंड दट एन एंगल नाइंटी डिग्री अट एन एंगल नाइंटी डिग्री सो वी शुड अलाउ द लाइट लाइक दिस एंड इट एंटर्स द प्रिजम एंड हि एंड हि सो देर विल बी दियार विल बी द रिफ्लेक्शन ओके देन it bends like this and now we bend the light at an angle at an angle 180 degree this is incident angle this is reflected angle so this is also by the tir